once in a lifetime moment. My brother and the best rapper alive, Louise. What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, welcome. My name is Brittany Johnson. Today's vlog is going to be a fun one. I'm headed to LA for my very first influencer event. Um, Amazon sent me an invite and this is like an invite only type of a situation. My very first influencer event. Um, so I'm literally, I just parked at the airport um, in Indy and I'm about to get on a plane and go to LA, California. Like what? So wild. I'm traveling alone, my very first time ever doing anything like this. Um, I'm meeting some friends there um, at the hotel, so I'm really excited about that. I'll feel way more not anxious and nervous once I'm with them. But um, yeah, and these girls are from all different states, um, but they were invited as well. One of them I was already friends with, her name's Bree. Um, I've been friends with her for a couple years. And then the other two, um, I'm just now like getting to know. Um, but we've had a group chat going on for the last like month or so. And so we've really gotten to know each other there and we've just been like really go growing closer there. So I'm loving that. But anyway, I'm excited to vlog this. I don't know how much I can show, but I think I'll be able to show a decent amount. Um, today's Wednesday and um, it's a five hour flight and it's four, it's 2.30 right now. My flight's at 4.30. Um, and so I'll get there in LA time at like 6.15, but it'll be like 9.15 in Indiana time. But, um, cause there's like a three hour time difference. I'm trying to hurry cause I really gotta get going. So it's basically all day Thursday, all day Friday. And then I'll be flying back Saturday morning. The two days are basically like from like nine to six are gonna be like full of like learning and workshops, um, all about like being an Amazon creator, Amazon influencer, which is what I am for fashion and um, beauty. And so, I'm so excited to learn. I'm just gonna like soak in every single moment because this is like a once in a lifetime moment for me. Never done anything like this. And I'm so excited, so grateful that I have this opportunity. And I'm just gonna take it one day at a time, one step at a time and just put my best foot out there. Try to not be social, socially anxious. I think I'll be fine once I'm with people, but it's going to be so weird just seeing like tons of influencers because I live where I'm not around anybody who does anything like I do. So I'm just really excited to meet everybody and to be um, introduced to so many people. Like I'm going to meet so many different people here. So I'm excited to like grow friendships and all that um, network and everything and learn. Thursday night, they're having a concert and then Friday night, they're having a red carpet event. So there's two like big events we're doing after the daytime. It's gonna be literally jam packed. We only have like an hour in between the daytime and the nighttime, which is insane um, for all the influencers to get ready and glammed up and whatnot. So it's just gonna be a wild ride. And I'm gonna try to document as much as I can with you guys, cause for my memories also, cause I love, that's why I vlog. I love seeing, being able to watch old videos back. Um, but I also just want to share this memory and moment with you guys because I started with YouTube first and yeah, anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and get all my suitcases out. I just have one suitcase and then like a carry on bag in my purse, but I'm going to get going. So stay tuned. Hi y'all. I'm at the shelter. <laughs> I'm at shelter 10. They have this little heat lamp. You can literally push for heat. I know I probably sound so like uncultured right now. I'm like, oh, there's a button for heat. <laughs> but it's keeping me warm because I'm about to be in like 70 degree weather at California and I just wore this jacket. It's gonna keep me warmish, but obviously like it's literally snowing outside right now. But I'm just waiting on, literally when I was vlogging, I saw the, like the, bus drive by that I was supposed to get on it's obviously gonna come come by in like the next couple minutes so it's fine but I literally if I didn't if I didn't do my little intro I could have been already in the airport but that's okay it'll be here soon <sighs> but anyway Before can't take this anymore. 
Cause I've been looking for something to change thoughts into motion Been waiting way too long Yeah, waiting just for somebody to love and to surround me And to handle my emotions I was out waiting for something And if I close my eyes It's all been a waste of time All right, y'all, I got into the hotel room. I'm with my girls. This is, do you like Olivia or Liv? I'm whatever you want to call it. Okay, this is Liv, Brie, and Amanda. So I'll leave all of their handles in the description box, but we're about to go out to dinner. It's eight o'clock here, but it would be like, well, y'all are like 10. Like, yeah, like 10 o'clock, it's late. Is it 11? Three, three hours. hours? Yeah, oh my gosh. <laughs> Yeah, but we all made it. We're so pumped. And we're about to go get some at Joey's. Is that what it's called? So, whatever that is. Yep. You stick it to Charlotte. I know. I was going to say, now we're all ready. No, we just ordered the so. Uber. And look at me. <laughs> Are you shocked though? I mean, we're looking good. We're all dressed and ready to go. <laughs> Let's go. How do we end up here? in here and I thought it was like I mean it is like a porter potty but it's like I'm pretty sure this is like 
a camper or something because look at this. <laughs> There's like full on stuff and then they have like dry bar products for you to like freshen up if you need to. They even have like a wand and a, and a straightener. Like what the heck? I'm definitely gonna have to uh, use some of that stuff. <laughs> but I'm having an absolute blast. I'm like shook meeting so many people, learning so many things, feeling so blessed and thankful to be here. Like this is a an experience and I'm so grateful. There's like a couple hundred people here. So I'm just like, how was I chosen? That's insane. It's just like it's crazy. Angelinos, Indiana. Yep. Oh, it's long. Yeah. Oh, posting this, I put a lot of like amazing and seeing a cake stand in it or like a little. I mean, this thing, it looks like you made it. We have four creators here who have made the job to full time. And they're going to share with us a little bit about their stories. It's your phone. Oh, sorry. Yeah, you went off with your purse clear. Okay. Yeah. okay. I've just been, I feel like not talking a ton in the vlog, but just showing clips and everything. We've been so busy. Uh, yesterday was so fun. We, they had lots of panels. We learned a lot and heard a lot from a lot of like top influencers and stuff, top Amazon creators. So that was really fun. And we got a really big like bag full of like tons of goodies. So I'm definitely gonna have to, I will be overweight on my uh, bag that I'm checking in on the, air, on the airplane. So I'll be paying for that, but that's okay. I'm super grateful. We're on day two, this is the last day, and then tonight we have the red carpet, like, cocktail event, so we were waiting on our valet car, so it's here, and they were, I was about to be left. I just saw them, I was like, oh wait, hold on. So we're heading to the, one of the girls who was staying here, um, she lives over here in LA, so she was like, I had a valet, or I valeted my, my car, so we're gonna get in her car. We've been Ubering and doing Lyft vehicles the whole time, so this is great. <laughs> recently published a book, which I think some of you are getting. <laughs> um, and influencing for a long time, since 2012. I'm the host of the Life of Mariana podcast, and I'm also co-founder of Summer Fridays, a skincare brand that is available on Amazon. It's really important to me. Let's, let's pick back up once this is launched, so that we can, you know, enjoy it. Like, that bask in, in the success of it. 
and then the last thing is action. So you can do all the research, you can write all the things down in your notebook, but if you're not actively putting forth the action to make it happen, it's not going to go anywhere. We got shake and grease I have not. <laughs> Have that on your thing, you just have, okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm not working. Oh, okay. Okay. obviously but I'm gonna check in my bag soon or literally like right after I get done vlogging this little clip right here I just wanted to check in um, we got so much like goodies from Amazon I lucked out because my friend Bree um, she had she had to buy new luggage when she got here because her bag like completely got broken in the plane like it broke a wheel off and everything so she had to buy new luggage at Target, I believe, and it came with like an extra travel bag, which is like right here. And she didn't have room to take it or like space, and she was like, "I'm just gonna like leave for the hotel." And I was like, "Well, let me put all of my stuff from Amazon in there, and that'll be my like uh, carry-on because I have like my little bag here, but this could be considered a like a personal." So that worked out. Hopefully, my bag won't be overweight or anything, and then. I can get that checked in and ready to go. So I'm here early because I didn't want to ride my, in the Uber by myself. So I was just basically, um, one of the girls is getting on the plane at seven. Mine's at like 9.50. So I'm gonna go get my bags checked in, probably grab some Starbucks and go sit um, at my gate and just get some work done. Cause I haven't had time to just like sit and like work a little bit. Like, I don't know. I had this whole plan of like having like content edited and um like ready to post so I wasn't like missing out on consistently um posting and all that but I completely I didn't do that or I didn't have any time to like I had no downtime of just sitting there and working because I was just like kind of just taking in everything and trying to be like in the moment and all that but yeah anyway let's do this thing with you by my side If you're in need, me here tonight Be brave and come along I'll be alright Promise we don't need no brake lights We can travel the world so 
What's up guys? It is currently 6 11. I don't have the best lighting because it's literally dark. I got to my car finally. It took forever for my bags uh, to like arrive. So I'm eight all day and I'm starving. So I'm gonna grab some Chick-fil-A and I'm going to head home. So yes. I'm excited i need to eat some food and i'm so 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 excited to get home i was like there was like little kids at the airport that were just um some of them were being like just like kids you know and i was just like oh i can't wait to squeeze my babies um that flight was like i could not i was i was dumb and did not go to the bathroom before i got on and i had a window seat and i was like I'm just gonna try to hold it so I don't have to make people get up because the people that were like right next to me, the two people, they had like their trays full of stuff like doing things and I was like, oh my gosh, just hold it, Brittany. But I could not fall asleep and I needed to sleep. I could not fall asleep because I had to pee so bad. So I finally was like, Brittany, you literally don't know these people. Don't worry about them being annoyed, which they weren't. They were like literally so sweet about it. I was just like, I need to go to the bathroom. I'm so sorry. And they were like, you're fine. So anyway to the bathroom and then I finally fell asleep after that for about like 45 minutes maybe not I don't, it was a, not an hour but but I woke up I like fell asleep and I woke up um and it felt a little definitely better um I'm still obviously exhausted and I will be going to bed early today but hopefully I mean it's literally gonna be like almost eight o'clock when I get home and I'm gonna want to spend time with my fam um we have church in the morning though so we'll be having to get up early and do that but that's okay I'm excited to just get home to my babies and my husband but first Chick-fil-A oh I'm hiccuping but yeah I'm so proud of myself for doing this um like just like doing that whole airport thing and traveling and like getting my car like I just I don't ever do this without like John or my husband like John or my husband you know what I mean my husband um yeah this is just like such a like alone alone trip and I don't know I'm just proud of myself for figuring things out because there was a couple things I had to figure out today and I was like uh but I gotta figure it out and I'm here now I just gotta get home so we've, I'm just gonna I'm just rambling at this point and I'm about to get my order taken so peace out